In this video, we will demonstrate self-treatment of two of the gluteal muscles and the tensor fascia lata, or TFL. The gluteal muscles are located from this large bone in the hip and fan out onto the crest all the way into here. The tensor fascia lata muscle, or the TFL, starts at the front portion of the hip and runs at an angle towards the back of the knee and ends about right here. Referred pain from the gluteus medius extends here over the crest of the hip in a C-shaped pattern like this. When we compress trigger points in that aspect of the hip, we can see that pain pattern emerge. Also, there is another trigger point in the gluteus medius muscle that can refer pain directly over the sacrum right here. When we compress that trigger point, we can see the pain pattern pop up over here. The gluteus minimus has a much more distant pain pattern as it may refer pain here into the buttock, down the back of the thigh, and into one half of the calf. When we compress trigger points, which are usually located over the seam of the pant, we can see that pain pattern up here. Many people refer to this pain pattern as sciatica. There's another pain pattern from the gluteus minimus which causes pain to run down the side of the thigh, the side of the knee, and end up in the ankle. When we compress these trigger points, which generally lie underneath the seam of the pant, we can cause that pain pattern to appear. The tensor fascia lata, or TFL, which runs from the front part of the hip at an angle towards the back side of the knee, could cause pain pattern to appear right here over the hip joint and extend to about halfway down the thigh on the side. When we compress the trigger points located in, the, in this muscle, we can see that pain pattern. Self-treatment of the gluteal muscles usually requires some diligence to get the proper pressure and angle. To treat, sit on a semi-hard surface and place the novel two beside the hip. We're going to want to place the novel in very tight towards the hip so that we're not angling the pressure too high uh, above the iliac crest or into the ribs. So we're going to place the novel inward and then we're going to have Erica lower her body onto the product and she can use her elbow, her upper body, to maneuver herself on the novel and thus create different angles of pressure. You may work on different aspects of the muscle by repositioning the novel over the entire area of the gluteals. If you happen to be using the product in bed, you may want to use a magazine to set the novel on top of in order to provide a little bit more of a firm surface. If you happen to use it on a floor, we can take a towel and place the towel over top of the novel to take a little bit of the hardness out of the product. Treatment of the TFL can be done while in a seated position with either the novel or the jack knobber. In this case, Erica prefers using the jack knobber to treat the TFL. First, we're going to want to locate the muscle by finding the bony front part of the hip here and then sliding just a little bit back and we're going to treat the area from here down to about here. She's going to take the jack knobber and she's going to use both hands to cover the product and compress gently into the muscle and to find any trigger points and tenderness that might be there. The best thing you can do here is to try to keep the muscle relaxed and once relaxed, more sensation referred pain may be felt into the hip joint and down into the center part of the thigh.